Now, which two of you are from the Philly area? On the, on the uh, far I'm end. Liam. Uh, I'm Liam. I'm from Pipersville. Uh, this is Brendan, and then Jim is from Abington. Well, I have to say, when I saw your audition on AGT, like the moment that you opened your mouth, I was like, <laughs> oh, I was. I was blown away. I thought I was listening to a recording. We all kind of have a uh, musical theater background. Um, me and Jim went to Penn State uh, and Brendan went to Ithaca for theater. Um, so that's always kind of been a part of us, but we also obviously love all different kinds of music and pop music and Disney and, and all kinds of stuff. Uh, so randomly when uh, Brendan just asked me and Jim to come and sing, uh, we kind of figured that that was the was right like, song. We felt like that was the vibe, like the yeah. Disney, but it has kind of the, the theatrical element. Uh, yeah. So we ended up putting uh, our own spin on it, which uh, we've recently uh, coined as t 3 ifying a song. <laughs> uh, but uh, I think it was just us making up a, a, a new way to approach that song, and, and now we got to do it on America's Got Talent, which was amazing. When did T3 come to be? Not for a minute. I mean, for a while, we were just Jim, Liam, and Brendan singing songs. Uh, even in even well into quarantine, um, we we didn't become a group group until I don't know, maybe four months after we started like just making covers, and you know, we never really stopped. So we were just like, I guess, I guess this is a group now. You know, it was a very <laughs> cool like organic foundation, and so uh, yeah, I guess. just kind of something to do with for the three of us and then evolved into like an actual thing yeah. that, that we're doing all over the country Defying gravity I think I'll try you started in this acapella group uh, you supported each other along the way now here you are on America's Got Talent I mean how surreal is this I think that's the perfect word. It's it's a whirlwind. I, I don't think any of us have really caught up with the effort. Every day we're doing this. We're rehearsing. We're uh, trying new outfits. We're on stage and perfecting our stage uh, performance for Tuesday. It's like it's constantly moving and, and having uh, awesome interviews and you know things like that. Simon Cow, <laughs> he loved you guys though. <laughs> it was that was such a surprise because you're always like. Oh my gosh, Simon Cowell, like, what's gonna happen? And then he was like the most effusive and, and, and nice and, and generous in terms of, of complimenting us, which was incredible. It was wild. Are you out there? Do you know me? Can you feel me? I'm sure fans cannot wait to see your performance tonight. Can you give us any hints at all about what we can expect to see? Yeah. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be loud. Energetic. Energetic and there's gonna be a lot of colors and, and stuff. We're gonna be just as, as shocked, as shocked and in awe of it as everyone else.